hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is princess phillips i'm an international student living in toronto canada so fam it's looking like i may be getting a job today eh, eh, eh. you know how in my previous videos i told you how getting a job was hard for me because of my schedule and I'm, I'm here with my son so i'm not available weekends daycare closes by 5 30 p.m and i have to drop him off by 8 so i have a very limited window but luckily um i got a call yesterday and we had a phone interview and the guy was impressed and he said i should come in today for another like quick chat and orientation so emphasis on orientation so fam i may be having a job in the next four hours so anyway, I'm going to take you with me Um, let's see, I really hope I get this job like, it don't, not like I have to work, but I want to work like my livelihood is not dependent on this job, but I just want to have the experience and you know, I was in Bahamas for three years and I couldn't like earn any money. So now I'm here. I really, really want to work like no matter how small it is like humble beginnings like a humble girl that i am so i'm going out now i had so much errands to run today i needed to go return like two jackets our winter jackets and switch them came in late and i can't make the bus because it's like an hour away if i'm using the bus so it's not like i'm sad i can't make the bus like that bus life is very stressful like can we be honest for a minute and just that bus life is very stressful and then when you now even enter the subway there is no network so if you don't have like a book or you forgot your book or something everybody just staring at everybody like and then you're reading that poster again and again and again it's just so boring down there i really don't like taking public transport because uh, it's just so hard to match this time like i can't plan because it's like oh okay what if i go and the bus is not there the bus is delayed or something anyway enough of my rambling so your girl is about going out i'm gonna order lift and you see how i wore my wig today like fam i'm not even this is not my low cut way and then my low cut is so high so the top of my wig is so bouncy so that's how that's why i use the band just to like bring it down so yes i'm about leaving and i will see you later i hope i have a job because fam i'm not gonna post this video if i don't have a job if not at the end of the video it will be like okay we tried but and yes another tip i want to give like how i got this job some people may be asking i applied on indeed like i applied everywhere like on indeed alone i sent out like 80 applications different roles like anything i knew i was capable of doing like grocery stores i applied there i applied to be a baker i'm not even a baker i don't even like baking but i applied to be a baker i applied everywhere so the secret is when you come keep an open mind and spread your cv because you don't know which one is gonna work i didn't know this one would have worked like when i got that call i was so shocked yesterday because now i'm in this like customer care phase i didn't know i even applied for that although i have hr experience and also please keep an open mind and push your cv everywhere because you don't know which one will come through and then also go to the malls check the, the once you go to the mall and you see someone that is hiring they write it there like they're not hiding it there. you see anything in the mall like where they're saying you're hiring print out your cvs and drop it there or then you ask for the manager always speak to the manager don't speak to any other person there don't speak to an associate speak to the manager hand over your cv or you ask for an email address to drop it but i always prefer handing over my cv because they always ask like do you have a hard copy so print your cv and just farm drop it everywhere anyway this is advice coming from someone that will soon be a worker would you stay till the morning light or would you follow me or would you let it be if i leave tonight we could do this right we'll find the remedy or would you stay with me now till the morning light for you turn away i just want you to know that i didn't throw your stuff away before you make up your mind that i'm nowhere to find them still I'm 
so I was and excited and everything and I really really hard I think it's because if I would have spent a whole chunk of my money <laughs> right here I know that I told you we're over I swear that I'm sober just listen I miss you and I know that I said all these things but now when you're with her I can see that that you miss So happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I got a job. I got a job. I got a job. <laughs> so the interview went so well, like so very well. Like we just sat and it felt like I was just chatting. I don't know what's wrong with my wig at this point. Let me wear my glasses. I need to start finding my way back home but yes your girl has a job now as a human resource assistant <laughs> I'm so happy like fam oh finally I have a job I'm gonna make money anyways minimum wage but I'm gonna make minimum wage money ah <sighs> I'm so happy. Anyway, this is oh my hands are pinning me. Alright, so this is the end of this video. I hope you liked it because I am now employed in Canada as a human resource assistant. Anyway, bye. See you in my next vlog. Oh, would you stay with me now till the morning?